Ladies and gents, I am the bearer of bad news this week. Within the last hour of writing this here video, E3 announced that their yearly convention in Los Angeles has been canceled due to the ongoing coronavirus pandemic. So June 9th through the 11th is a no-go. Really early this morning, uh, there was a report going around that by 9 a.m. Pacific time, there would be an announcement via press release that would confirm this year's E3 cancellation. And that is exactly when the announcement was made. They think this is the best way to proceed given that this is such a big global situation. Full refunds are going to be given and they're thinking of doing a digital showcase that can be a platform for the gaming companies to get out the announcements that they'd like to make. But that's far from a sure thing. They said that they still hope to showcase industry updates in June of 2020 and we can certainly have our fingers crossed for that and that they arrange something. Because certainly they had some stuff planned out before this outbreak spread. And with various live streaming platforms available across the web, there could still be a form of E3 online rather than a physical showcase in LA. But if that doesn't pan out, they say they look forward to E3 of 2021. Now, even before this coronavirus stuff, Sony had been absent from the previous year's E3, and they announced that they would be skipping it again this year. And there was also some rumblings that Nintendo would also not be having any physical setups and only planning on streaming their accompanying Direct. So no Treehouse Live or playing any different things on location in the convention center. But again, that was never confirmed, just a big-time rumor floating around. But now... No companies at all are going to be involved because the event has been shit-canned. Even before the news broke out early this morning, there have been rumblings of this going down as early as the start of this week. And now here we are at midweek, and E3 2020 will not be happening. So this really could impact Nintendo. For a while now, before the coronavirus spread, I was thinking Nintendo would hold off all the way until E3 week to do their first Direct of the year. But now that E3 is no longer happening, they very well could do that Direct any time. I've heard rumors we could get one at the end of March, and I personally do think that's rather unlikely. But certainly we could get it at the start of quarter two and say April, rather than wait all the way until June for it, like we would have if E3 was still occurring. So, what are you guys thinking now that perhaps the biggest Western gaming convention of the year has been scrapped due to a raising pandemic? Do you think they'll do a digital showcase to at least announce some things that would have been at the convention itself? Will there be nothing? And when do you think Nintendo will have their first Direct of the year and decade? As of now, it's been over half a year since we had our last general Nintendo Direct. The absolute longest drought ever since the Switch launched three years ago. I would love to hear your guys' opinions about all this stuff. As you faithful subscribers who stuck around can see, I made a big time rebranding across all my social media platforms. So do add me on Discord, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, add my Nintendo Switch friend code, and you could be involved in future streams on Twitch at Braster as well. So give me a follow on my Twitch.tv account. And as you can see, everything in the links and the ads are all here in this beautiful, wonderful graphic. So, all of this is so very appreciated if you can follow me here. And, again, did you notice the last two graphics? That's going to lead to the two biggest shoutouts of all time. One, to my Apron Bumps podcast co-host, Mr. Gabe Nozid, and two, to his sister Robin for the wonderful graphics. They really tie the channel together. The two of them collaborated to make Yours Truly's channel completely better than ever. So give Gabe a subscribe on his channel, and uh, she hasn't quite decided yet, but his sister wants me to plug one of her social media uh, platforms. It will be in the description. It might not be as soon as this uh, video is uploaded, but uh, if you can come back to it, the link will be provided in the description when she gives me it. Uh, Gabe's YouTube channel is on my channel under affiliate channels, and his uh, channel link will also be listed in the description. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.